My father was born with this incredible passion for shoemaking and since he was a very young kid that's the only thing he wanted to do in life and convince his parents that he was going to become a shoemaker. That brought him to learn uh, about shoemaking in his, the village where he was born, a small village close to Naples, and uh, to emigrate to America basically exactly 100 years ago. That's where he started his career with his uh, elder brothers and sister. And he convinced them to move from Boston, where they were living, to Santa Barbara, California, and they opened together a shoe repair shop that soon transformed in a shoe saloon and making shoes for the stars in Hollywood uh, at the time when the cinema was uh, basically starting. My father would never compromise in quality and he could not find in America that quality, that craftsmanship in shoemaking that he had uh, experimented in his uh, neighborhood. So he had this brilliant idea to come back to Italy and establish a production here to export to America. So it was basically the start of the Made in Italy in fashion and that was in uh, uh, 1927. Opened the first uh, Salvatore Ferragamo shops in London, in Zurich, uh, in Rome and in Milano. He never stopped. He wanted to make the best shoes that uh, anybody else could make with creativity, with quality, with uh, functionality elements. Uh, so he was determined. He, he believed in what he was doing. So today, this uh, story of my father, who passed away in 1960, is still so very present in uh, my family, in our company, in the activities that we do. On top of this, we have the Ferragamo Museum, where all this story is kept alive. Uh, we have some uh, 14,000 pieces between shoes, sketches, patterns, uh, etc., which is an incredible asset for us. Many of the uh, great celebrities from the past, uh, from uh, Marilyn Monroe, Dora Swanson, uh, Audrey Hepburn, and I could go on and on. And it was at the time uh, also very much the glamour, these great celebrities they were the first one to enter in the, uh, the cinema, and um, they would come to Palazzo Ferroni to have their shoes made. I think uh, all our lives we have been uh, trained to uh, quality, to service, uh, to lifestyle. Uh, getting into the hospitality was an extension of our experience uh, uh, because also hospitality is, it is about uh, style, it is about service, it is about creating an atmosphere around uh, what you deliver. We very much had at heart to do this. Uh, uh, we wanted to do it uh, in a way so that uh, the name is not present, uh, but it is behind. Uh, I said to myself, uh, I don't want to create just one more hotel. Uh, I want uh, our hotels to be different. Uh, well, both in the Ferragamo shop, we deliver a shopping bag, and the same, I think, we deliver in uh, one of the Lungarno collection hotels. Uh, the one uh, in Ferragamo is a shopping bag which is full of items. In uh, the hotels, it has to be a shopping bag full of lovely memories. I always have had a lot of respect for the leading hotels of the world, for their organization. To be honest, it's a dream come true. We wanted to include in the leading an hotel which hopefully is going to surprise positively many of the leading hotel customers. And I think the portrait Florence, like the the portrait of Rome are going to really give uh, some uh, very important messages. Uh, uh, they have an identity of their own, they have a style, uh, uh, an atmosphere which is uh, maybe not so easy to match. Dear Ted, dear staff of the leading hotel of the world uh, and uh, dear uh, members of this lovely association, uh, I wish you heartily a lovely session of work uh, I hope to this uh, short video I was able to express uh, some of the passion and uh, the values that I have at heart, uh, but especially 
how proud we at Lungara Collection all are for having joined this uh, wonderful uh, organization and uh, to be part of uh, such a nice and lovely and inspiring group of people. Uh, you have done a lot for this uh, organization so as to make it be so respected around the world. Have good sessions, have lovely work uh, and also lots of fun.